At the best of times, they're creepy crawly, but at the worst of times, bugs and pose a risk to humans. Today, we're going to see everything from giant bugs with powerful bites, to tiny mites with parasites, and how about a bug bite that killed you decades later? Hold on tight, subscribe to the channel, and let's take a closer look at the 10 most dangerous bugs on planet Earth. Number 10. Bullet Ants The bite from this aptly named creature is said to be so painful that it is quite similar to getting shot. The bullet ants bite isn't fatal, but you might wish it was. The ant's venom attacks the central nervous system, causing waves of intense pain and shaking, and accelerated heart rate. On the bright side, the effects only last from 12 to 24 hours. That's not so bad, right? The better news is, however, is that you are pretty unlikely to come across one unless you frequent the rainforest of Nicaragua. The bad news is that there is a pretty good chance that you have already encountered our number one entry. Stick around to find out why it's so deadly. Number 9. Giant Hornets In a single Chinese city in 2013, over 43 people were killed and 1,000 were injured by this enormous hornet that can boast a wingspan of over 3 inches. One worker was so badly injured in an attack that she required 13 dialysis treatment and over 200 stitches. The Chinese government is so shaken by the attacks that they immediately began an aggressive eradication effort to exterminate vast numbers of giant hornets. While the government's retaliation may have seemed drastic, if left unchecked, these massive hornets spread rapidly. During any given breeding season, a female giant hornet will birth as many as 2,000 young. The giant hornet's sting is delivered by a 6mm long stinger that injects a potent venom once, inside the victim. The hornet's venom begins killing red blood cells in turn causing kidney failure and anaphylactic shock. Before we go on, like this video, pop the subscribe button, and ring the notification bell right now, or the ghost in your closet will manifest itself tonight. Number 8. Fleas At first, you may not even consider these tiny critters to be much of a threat. But these astoundingly common pests actually pose a number of risks to human and pets. One thing that makes fleas particularly hard to defend against is that not only are they tiny, but they are incredibly mobile being capable of covering up to 8 inches in a single jump, which is roughly equivalent to a human jumping the length of 20 football fields. In humans, their bite causes an uncomfortable itch that can lead to infection, but the consequences for pets can be far more dire. Some major risks posed to pets include allergic reactions and anemia. Furthermore, they can live for approximately 100 days, producing as many as 250,000 young every 30 days. Number 7. Kissing Bug At first glance, the kissing bug seems to have a great deal in common with a bed bug. For instance, both are attracted to humans because of our CO2 output, and both prey on people at night. However, where bed bugs are extremely tiny, kissing bugs can reach an inch in length, and their bite and feces are both major sources of disease. Specifically, Chagas disease, which launches a slow and meticulous attack on the victim's body over a period of decades. The kissing bug strikes while the victim is asleep, and symptoms don't show up for weeks. After suffering flu-like symptoms, the victim will appear to recover. However, over the next 10 to 30 years, severe complications begin to occur. These include swelling of the esophagus, heart, and colon heart palpitations, or intestinal blockage. Even scarier is that most people's first indication that they have the disease is heart failure. Treatment exists, but is so aggressive and bears such severe complications that it is discontinued in as many as 50% of cases. The lesson here? Avoid kissing bugs at all costs. Number 6. Brown Recluse Probably one of the most severely misunderstood spiders in North America, the brown occluse isn't so much unjustly demonized as it is inaccurately demonized. Venom from the brown recluse is so powerful that it can melt human skin, flat, and blood cells via necrosis. Luckily, this is fairly rare, and the majority of bites result in minor discomfort, swelling, and redness. Without medical treatment, these symptoms often resolve themselves in as few as three days. However, when large amounts of venom are released, other effects include ulcers, 
fever, nausea, joint pain, and even seizures. However, when it comes to a brown recluse bite, the real challenge may not be so much in avoiding one as managing to get one. While their bite can be bad, the brown recluse is certainly not aggressive and will go out of its way to avoid crowded or noisy areas, typically favoring abandoned homes and attics. Number 5. Tsetse Fly The tsetse fly doesn't have a stinger, choosing instead to bite its victims with its straw-like mouth. If the simple image of that isn't enough to turn your stomach, the real danger of the tsetse fly is that it frequently injects its victims with nasty tropical diseases. Following a tsetse bite, victims typically experience headache, stiffness, and fever. As time goes on, their condition worsens, causing extreme fatigue and earning it the name sleeping sickness. Fortunately, exhaustion and stiffness are only the beginning. As the illness progresses to the brain, it can cause mood changes, confusion, and coordination problems. While treatments exist, the challenges are similar to treatment for Chagas disease, often being far more detrimental than beneficial to the patients. Number 4. Botflies Botflies have some of the most peculiar habits of all of today's entries. After they find a mate and the female is ready to lay her eggs, she does so in the bodies of other living insects, and sometimes even humans. This is where the real trouble starts. The newly hatched botflies immediately burrow into the host's skin where they feed until they are fully grown. Then they fly off and repeat the process. Unfortunately, while the bot fly is inside the host, the cause extreme itching, disease, and often infection. Luckily, treatment for embedded bot flies is pretty straightforward. Doctors will usually prescribe an antibiotic and physically remove the fly with tweezers. An alternate and strangely less painful extraction method is to cover the entry point with a piece of bacon. Like everyone, bot flies love bacon and willingly attach themselves to it. Then you can simply discard the bacon with the attached fly. They might be gross parasites, but at least they have good taste. Number 3. Killer Bees What do you get if you cross a European honeybee with an African honeybee? Well, you get a bee with a far less innocuous name, a killer bee. Unlike killer whales, which have never actually killed anyone in the wild, killer bees have been responsible for over 1,000 deaths. These bees may have only a moderately powerful venom, However, they attack quicker and more aggressively than other bee species, and will chase their target for distances upward of a quarter mile. Unfortunately, because attacks are so difficult to escape, victims often include children and the elderly. Killer bees aren't just a threat to humans, and have been known to fatally attack household pets, butterflies, bats, and birds. And if you're wondering how fast you have to run in order to evade a killer bee attack, the answer is about 17 miles per hour. Number 2. Giant Water Bug in parts of North America, South America, and Northern Australia, there exists a truly alien-looking bug that you don't want to cross paths with. It makes its home near rivers and reservoirs, and lies in wait, camouflaged as a leaf. This four and a half inch long creepy crawly is an adept hunter, capable of taking down small turtles, fish, tadpoles, snails, and amphibians. The water bug first latches onto its prey with powerful front pincers, before driving in a proboscis that injects saliva. In humans, this results in an excruciating bite that has been said to be worse than that of a bullet ant. In animals, the bite results in paralysis and the liquefaction of their innards, which the water bug then drinks, similar to how spiders often pre-digest food. Ew, no thanks. Number 1. Mosquitoes Mosquitoes seem like such a standard nuisance in many developed countries that we often underestimate the impact they have on human beings. While it might be difficult to really appreciate the magnitude of the mosquitoes' impact while they are buzzing around you at a barbecue, the reality is that they kill millions of people each and every year. It is considered one of the deadliest creatures on the planet. Contrary to popular belief, Humans aren't simply the chosen meal of mosquitoes. In fact, mosquitoes eat many other things, including nectar, algae, bacteria, sap, and honeydew. The only mosquitoes that ever feed on blood are the females of the species, and it is only done out of necessity to nourish the eggs. Without this meal, she is incapable of laying her eggs. However, the side effects for humans are dire. Mosquitoes can lead to malaria, Zika virus, 
yellow fever, West Nile virus, and dang fever. That's all for 10 most dangerous bugs on planet Earth. Which creepy crawly was your favorite? Have you heard of similar creatures? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to TrendJoint for more incredible videos. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.